Hi, passionate Rangers FC fans. Welcome to Rangers Update, your dedicated source for all things Rangers. Before we dive in, we want to express our gratitude for your unwavering support. If you bleed blue, don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button, and let's strengthen our community. Now, let's get into the latest updates, a hearty welcome to our new followers. Your backing means the world to us. WATP, let's get to the news. With Abdullah Saima and Fabio Silva's futures hanging in the balance, the former more probable than the latter to secure a permanent move to Ibrox, budget permitting, Philippe Clement's Scottish Premiership runners-up find themselves scouring the market for wide players. In their quest, versatility is key, the ideal candidate would thrive on either flank, come at a bargain price, and boast a knack for finding the back of the net with consistency. Among the names linked with Rangers is Adama Traoré, the Ferenc Varro's forward, distinct from his Fulham namesake. Reports suggest Rangers have set their sights on Traoré, along with interest from Stum Graz and, intriguingly, the aforementioned Cottagers. According to Africa Foot, Traoré, a 54-time Mali international, may depart for Renk Varos after clinching two Hungarian league titles during his two-year tenure. Having begun his career at French outfit Mets before truly flourishing at Sheriff Tyraspol, Traoré's contract is set to expire in 2025, pressuring for Renk Varos to offload him this summer to avoid losing him for nothing later on. At 28, Traoré surpasses the typical age profile of players targeted by Rangers under the Philippe Clement and Nils Koppen era. However, unlike the projects that were Oscar Cortez and Mohamed Diamond, Traoré arrives as a polished product, boasting invaluable experience, championship-winning pedigree, versatility, and an impressive European track record, all attributes that would undoubtedly entice a Rangers side aiming to improve domestically and on the continental stage in the upcoming season. Traoré's current season with Ferenc Varos has seen him notch 14 goals in 26 appearances. While he lacks Champions League experience, his notable tally of eight goals and three assists in 16 qualifying matches underscores his prowess on the European stage. Further enhancing Traoré's appeal is his reported blistering pace, allegedly reaching speeds of 34.14 km per hour, placing him in an elite category alongside the likes of Kylian Mbappe. Speaking on Traoré's return from injury, Ferenc Varro's coach and former Inter Milan stalwart Denon Stankovic hailed the forward's professionalism and importance to the team, highlighting the significant void his potential departure would leave. Meanwhile, the right-wing position has posed a persistent challenge for Rangers. While Ross McCausland shows promise, his youth suggests he may need time to fully develop. On the other hand, Scott Wright's performances have been inconsistent, Casting doubts on his ability to deliver consistently for a team harboring genuine title aspirations, despite his recent brace against Dundee. Wright shares a contract expiry date of 2025 with Traoré, making him the likely candidate to make way should the Ferenc Varos forward make the switch to Ibrox. Before we continue, make sure to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications to get all the exclusive news about Rangers FC. Don't overlook any details about your beloved team. It's crucial for Rangers FC fans. The vibrant streets of Glasgow are buzzing with anticipation as the Rangers football club contemplates a permanent deal for the talented Portuguese striker, Fovio Silva. Currently on loan from Wolverhampton Wanderers, Silva's impressive performances at Ibrox have ignited a wave of enthusiasm among fans and management alike. The potential for Silva to become a long-term fixture in the Rangers squad has supporters dreaming of future triumphs and glory. Fovio Daniel Suarez Silva, widely known as Fovio Silva, was born on July 19, 2002, in Porto, Portugal. The young striker comes from a footballing family, his father, Jorge Silva, was a notable player for Boa Vista, and his brother, also named Jorge Silva, is set to join Lazio for the 2023-24 season. Fovio's career began to garner attention early on when he helped his team secure the UEFA Youth League title in the 2018-2019 season, showcasing his potential on the European stage. Silva's journey to prominence accelerated on August 17, 2019, when he made his senior debut for FC Porto in the Primera Liga. Despite a disappointing team loss to Gil Vicente, the match was a personal milestone for Silva, as he became the youngest player in the club's history to start in a league game at just 17 years and 22 days old. 
This remarkable achievement was a testament to his talent and potential, setting the stage for his future successes. Since his arrival at Rangers, Silva has quickly ended himself to the fans with his flair, technical skill, and goal-scoring prowess. His ability to find the back of the net and create opportunities has been pivotal in many of Rangers' recent victories. The club's management is reportedly keen on making his stay permanent, believing that Silva could be a cornerstone of their attacking force for years to come. Fovio Silva's arrival at Rangers has injected a new dimension into the team's attacking prowess, thanks to his unique style of play and dynamic personality. Blessed with a keen eye for goal and impeccable technical ability, Silva possesses all the qualities of a modern-day striker. His agility, quick feet, and instinctive finishing make him a constant threat inside the box, capable of turning half-chances into goals with remarkable ease. Off the pitch, Silva exudes a quiet confidence and determination that belies his young age. Known for his professionalism and dedication to his craft, he approaches every training session and match with a relentless work ethic, earning the respect of teammates and coaches alike. His humble demeanor and willingness to learn from experienced players bode well for his development and integration into the Rangers squad. Under the tutelage of manager Philippe Clement, Silva has the opportunity to further refine his skills and make significant strides in his career. Clement's tactical acumen and emphasis on fluid, attacking football align perfectly with Silva's strengths, providing him with the ideal environment to thrive. As part of a talented ensemble cast at Rangers, Silva's addition adds depth and versatility to the team's attacking options, offering a potent blend of youth and experience. Moreover, Silva's versatility allows him to adapt to various tactical setups, providing Clement with valuable tactical flexibility. Whether deployed as a central striker, a supporting forward, or even in a wide attacking role, Silva's adaptability ensures that he remains a constant threat to opposition defences. His presence in the squad not only elevates the quality of the starting eleven, but also adds depth and competition for places, pushing his teammates to raise their game to new heights. As negotiations continue regarding his permanent signing, the excitement surrounding Fovio Silva's potential impact at Rangers grows with each passing day. With his blend of talent, personality, and work ethic, Silva has the makings of a true game-changer for the Glasgow Giants, capable of spearheading their pursuit of silverware both domestically and on the European stage. As the dawn of a new era beckons at Ibrox, all eyes are on Silva, eager to witness the next chapter in his burgeoning footballing journey. The prospect of securing Silva permanently has sparked widespread excitement among the Rangers' faithful. His youth, coupled with his already significant experience, positions him as a player who could help lead the club to new heights. As negotiations with Wolverhampton Wanderers progress, Rangers supporters eagerly await the outcome, hopeful that Silva's dynamic presence will become a permanent fixture at Ibrox. Greetings, fans! Make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel as it's greatly appreciated by Rangers FC. And don't forget to share your thoughts on the news in the comments section below. Until the next video, stay tuned.